NNA. Steel case 2012 NNA. Got a steel case. Got a little bit of separation on the bottom, but uh, otherwise, case is sealed. Now, last week, some people noticed that uh, some of my cards were damaged. And you can see this box actually has a little crunch on the corner here. So we could have damaged cars in here as well. Just happens. One dollar cars. So you know what? They just pack as many cars as they can in there. And uh, you know, if the box gets a little ding, stuff happens. But uh, nonetheless, uh, what else was I going to say? Oh, but you know, the, the air that was packed, you know that, uh, I think, what was it? The uh, Medic? I think it was the Medic. Had a big old... Uh, big old crunch on the front of the car and uh, that was obviously uh, packed broken had nothing to do with the damage on the box and you see some darkness in the corner could have something to do with the dark night let's see it there we go there's the bat and normally I like to uh, hurry through these things if yeah, kind of looks like a bug a little uh, Water something, a turtle, I don't know. Let's take a closer look. So we have uh, two rivets holding it together. Plastic, this bottom part is all plastic. Top part, metal. Kind of cool, look at the uh, front. You got a little canopy, a little cockpit area. Let me get a close look and see. Hey, uh, there's somebody in there. I don't know if you can see. You try to get it at the right spot. Yep, see him in the back there? It's hard. I got my uh, floodlight in the wrong spot there. But there's a guy sitting here. So, it's even hard for me to see it. Uh, wait a second. Nope, nobody's sitting there. Sorry. It's uh, just the seat itself. So, kind of interesting. <laughs> Very odd. Definitely made to look like a bug. Here you got uh, got like a like an armadillo. You got that flexible area. What other creatures would have that? Made in Malaysia. DC Comics. I wonder if it says the bat here. Production code E19. It's printed right here. I don't even see anywhere yet where it says the bat. What's it say here? The bat. Sorry for taking so long. I'm checking this out and uh, letting you guys get a pretty good look at it too. So these things will be hitting your stores soon, hopefully. You know, it just depends on when your uh, stores get their inventory. Yeah, I don't see the name of the bat on here at all, but we know what it is. You can watch from up there. Okay, now let's uh, let's hurry up. Spend enough time on that. I believe all three of these were in the M codes, M cases. Got three of the uh, Subaru W RX STI. I think this is a new color. Wasn't the last color a uh, bluish? Refresh my memory because for oh yeah, must must have been a new color because anytime they got a new one in the boxes, they always got multiples. So there's four of them. Hey, very nice new color. I think. Uh, I don't think this black one of the BMW Z4M, I don't think the black one was in the last case. Hey, new model. Looks like a Matchbox. What the heck is a Matchbox doing in here? Just kidding. Jeep Scrambler from the uh, Thrill Racers Prehistoric. Got four of this guy. What do we have here? You already seen this one last case, and there's one already in this case. Nice to see Diesel Boy back in the mix. You know, this casting's a little bit different. It was, uh, they changed at some point. Let me move my light so I have a little bit less of a problem here. Oh, yeah, nice new color of the uh, Fairline. Fairlane, sorry. Very nice. Brownness, got some glitter, got some uh, metal flake paint in there.
three of the uh, 70 Chevelle SS. Rodzilla, what the heck is this doing in here? Looks like it's an old car too. Let me check the back real quick. Dodge Dart. So here we got on the top of uh, N codes, N codes, N. Kind of looks odd, the color right here. Makes it look like it's uh, from an old card. Oh, what is this? Year of the Dragon Edition. This Hot Wheels Special Edition celebrates 2012, Year of the Dragon. The dragon is often associated with new beginnings and good fortune for all. Hey, pretty cool. Year of the Dragon Edition. Very cool. You know, the kids, uh, when they do the parties, they really like the Rodzilla. It's a fun model. These guys are already out in the other codes. Got a rec oh, finally a recolor of the Canyon Carver. It's been a while since we've seen it. It's not one that I normally would pick up. I'll see if my son wants it for his uh, motorcycle collection. As you notice, no treasure hunts yet. Treasure hunts are not guaranteed to be in every case. I got lots of case codes I've opened this year, and that's the uh, proof. Yay, I got a good one. It's not all uh, munched up. That would have been kind of bad if I got two in a row. There's the new color of the Eagle Masa. Split Vision. These three guys are already out in previous codes. Faster than ever. Mazda Fry Fry. You guys can go ahead and argue how it's pronounced. I don't know. I don't care. Torque Twister. Nice yellow color. These these two. This car was in the last assortment. Lamborghini Stoke. Now I've been seeing pictures of this online, and I think this is the first time it's had a side tampos like this. Let me know. I didn't uh, look it up when I noticed the uh, other pictures. Got three of them. Oh, nice. Ferrari 599XX is in this one too. Not good for the loops. You know that uh, front bumper drags as I showed you in the uh, Walmart uh, double loop there or something or other video. Nice tampos, like the flames. I'm not sure it makes much sense for it to be a fire chief, but uh, I love uh, love wagons. I just won't pay any attention to the uh, what it says there. These three previously out. Canine unit. Where's the dog? Where's the dog? Hey, if you're gonna make a canine unit, put a little dog on the seat like they would with some of the other. Ooh, look at this guy. Very nice. I usually don't buy too many of these. Uh, I love the Baja Breaker. It's a cool model, nice and big. But, you know, it doesn't fit on the track, so I try not to have too many of them in my collection. It looks like we're going to go over for O in the uh, treasure hunts here. Love this green on this car here on the Challenger concept. Got three left. We'll do the three that's face up, so this way the surprise will be those. These have already been out in the uh, last case. No, it hasn't. 2013! That means that these are probably the Viper, because whenever there's a new one in here, it's uh, got multiples. Very nice. Now, before I crack this one open, I better make sure... Yep, see, just as I thought. I better make sure that there isn't uh, a variation. Let's see. All the wheels look the same. All of them got tampos on top. Yeah, very, very nice. Very nice. But let's see, uh, the worst card, so who's going to be the uh, sacrifice? Oh, this, look at this one. This big old crease. Oh, by the way, I bought some, something off of eBay. Uh, crease on this. There, you can see it right there. I bought something off of eBay. Um, I can't remember the Saturn. A Saturn, and it was actually a dealer release of the Saturn. I, I get... I get the car in the mail. The guy said he's going to mail in a protector. He did mail in a protector, but he shipped it in a paper envelope. It's like, you know, you knucklehead. You knew exactly what you were selling because you you put it in a protector, and then you just 
throwing a paper envelope. Card arrived with the crease. I don't know if it's here actually. I might have put it away. Too much stuff. Oh well. Anyways, that's my case N and A. If I have any uh, errors or anything, I will just add them after this. So for right now, I'm. Oh look, here we go. Found it. So look, shipped it in a protector. But look at look right here. You can see uh, where the light is. See that crease? Shipped it in a paper envelope. Knucklehead. And then I left them a neutral because they shipped it. And they go, why didn't you tell me? I said, you know what? You knew what you're supposed to be selling. You put in a protector, then you stick it in a paper envelope. I'm going to mess around and sit there and talk to you back and forth about this. Are you kidding? You should have known. I ain't going to waste my time. Anyways, very cool. How many of you guys going to be picking up the bat? I don't. I pretty much stick to uh, track cars. But I might uh, pick up a couple of these little buggers, if you know what I mean. All right, there's one for the uh, Dark Knight back there. NNA, coming soon to stores near you. Okay, for you, those of you who might know, what does it say there on the side, right here? I can barely uh, speak English, uh, let alone try to understand another language. Pretty funny they put a face on the dragon there. But that temple, I think it's got the same temple here. What's it say? Anybody know? And you know what's cool about this model? Is they don't they don't always put the eyeballs on this guy. So that's pretty cool as well. Hey check out Diesel Boy. You can uh, see the driver. They don't have a uh, blacked out window. You can see a driver there. Most of the time most of the time they just black it out and you can't see. But uh, I don't know if you uh, know, knew about this either. You ever notice with the uh, card art? Most of the cars will have like this uh, oil stain here, but Ferrari said, uh-uh, you're not putting no oil stains on uh, our packages. And I didn't look at every package, but uh, there's definitely uh, M case carryovers. Where am I? M case carryovers from the uh, in this N case, and uh, even worse, uh, I really like the uh, El Camino, but. Uh, Geez, where do they where do they uh, hold where do they hold these cards when they uh, have carryovers like this? These things are all beat up, and they're in pretty bad shape. Unless they were on that corner that got dinged, I'm not sure. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching. That's it. Serious. That's it. Go home. Bye.